I'm Matt Holbrook with St. John Properties. I'm the regional partner. Danny Severin with St. John Properties. I'm assistant vice president. St. John Properties is a 51-year-old commercial real estate company. We uh, have about 22 million square feet of commercial real estate in nine states now. And uh, we are a privately held speculative builder, so we build for our own portfolio. So that means we have construction, leasing, design, property management, acquisition all in-house. We have about a million and a half square feet here in Frederick. We do. And uh, we're continuing to grow and to expand. This is our 25th year in Frederick. We're very excited. We, this community has been great. and we're, we're focused on Frederick. We want to keep growing. St. John Properties is a full service commercial real estate company. So that means under one roof we do acquisitions for commercial real estate, we do development, we do construction, we do design, we do interior construction, we do leasing, we do property management. It's all within our organization. So each one of those has its own career path that starts at some level and moves its way up. And so we at the company really appreciate and value growth from within. So people can start at different levels and positions in the company and expand into other roles. If you go through the silos of how the company operates, property management, so that's our customer service, our customer care division that deals with uh, the 225 tenants that we operate out of, out of the Frederick division. Of that, you could have a technician who is interacting with our clients, who is facilitating any of the needs of our facilities, whether that's repairing something or coordinating with a service contractor to fix something else or coordinating with a vendor to install something. From that, we have the leasing and sales division of our company that we often really find ourselves with the growth <clears throat> looking for somebody that can do design, somebody that can do computer-aided design, or now what we're seeing is Revit. Um, that's been a big focal point for us of how we can continue to be you know, modern with how we do our designs, how quick we can get something back to our clientele. That's been a big focus for us. None of this growth of our company happens without construction. So construction project management, whether that's from a tenant improvement side or a base building side, so building the structure of the building or building the inside for the customers similar to the facility that we're in right now. We're always hiring those groups and looking for those team members and then each one of those cycles has a pathway that they could advance through. Um, as well, we have a staff of 18 people in our office and we're always looking to grow from administrative capacity. As this world changes, as things change, we have reporting, we have administrative functions that keep up with the, the financial reporting for our company or the securities, bonds, permitting, all the items that are, that are critical to keeping our company moving as quickly and as efficiently as we can. We are a company that does sustained, responsible growth. And so for us, construction is a continuum. We are always constructing something. And so for us, always also looking for construction personnel. We, in recessions, in moderate growth climates, we are always on a sustained growth pathway. We don't adjust for that. As, as Matt alluded to it is with our company philosophy, we're a speculative builder. So we do not build buildings with users in mind. We build buildings and then go find the users. That's really important to us, but also then means we are construction forward facing. So critical to that is construction personnel. Secondary to that is as we continue to build, we have to continue to take care of our clients. So we have the property management group, which is always hiring, looking for new fresh faces that can continue to provide great service to our customers. And then I would just add to that, I think what's great about our organization is we love to bring in uh, bright, capable folks that share our company mission and our philosophy and can grow within our organization. So people start one place and yeah. they might gravitate towards another place in their career. I uh, am an entry-level employee. <laughs> uh, some days I still feel like one. That's any day that ends in a Y, I still feel that way. Uh, I was an intern in college, and I started out, I have a, a political science degree from York College, and I started in the accounts receivable department, which is a title within our company, lease administration, lease coordinator. So handling the accounts receivable, all the, the financial accounting of our tenants as they pay rent, as we do CAM reconciliations, all the financial functions of making sure we can answer the questions our tenants have, but also inputting that information into our system so that we can timely collect payments. Um, from that, I moved towards leasing. I did leasing for the bulk of my career, transitioned from that to development. 
I've been doing development for five years and then transitioned from development to double duty of development and then some um, office function as well in terms of managing, implementing strategy, those kinds of things. So I am a, a 15 year St. John Properties hire. Uh, it's the only job I've ever had, which is pretty unique in this day and age, I do believe. And it's something that St. John Properties has been able to offer me as I've grown and evolved uh, through, through my career. Um, I then added on a, a graduate degree from Johns Hopkins with a, an MS in real estate business. And that coupled with the growth opportunities provided by this company have allowed me to stay and keep growing in a community that I'm from. I went to Middletown High School, I'm from here, I still live here. Uh, so that coupled with this opportunity is one of the great success stories for myself personally. It's my only success story, but it, I do attribute it wholeheartedly to St. John Properties. And I would just pick up on that as well. In our headquarter location, which is in Baltimore, Maryland, there's a board in the lobby there, and it highlights employees that have worked with the company for over 10 years. And there are 100 people on the board, yeah, yeah. probably. So it's a testament to a company like ours where it rewards people that work hard and make great things happen and, and, and contribute to the overall mission of the company. So we love long-term stability. I've been in the company for about 13 years now. Um, originally started in the headquarter location and then 11 years ago um, came out to Frederick to join Danny and, and efforts here. So um, uh, I was, uh, my career took a lot of different turns and twists over the years. So I was already further along in my career when I joined St. John Properties, but then you know, fitted really well. It was a great organization. So a little different paths, but, yep. you know, similar, uh, similar place where we ended up. We are a growth organization, so we are always looking to add to our portfolio. So for for me, it's just it's a great, exciting place where there's always things happening. There's always new, exciting projects. There's always um, something that we didn't expect that we're we're managing and dealing with, but we're always moving forward. So there's growth, and with growth comes new opportunity. So there's been great opportunity to to do what I wanted to do and move up in the organization, but. I'd also just say, and especially our office, I would say we have a culture in our office that is r exceptional. It just, we have the privilege of getting to work with some really, really talented, kind, good people. And so when you spend a lot of work every day with these people, it's a real, a real pleasure to get to work with people that you actually like to work with and that work hard and are honest and direct and forthright and take really good care of our customers. And that's sort of mission number one in our portfolio. And so just getting to spend time with people like that is great. I'd say also there are some, some perks that go with it. Um, what would you say your your reasons for sticking around for 15 years? Yeah, no, it's it's a great question. So it's it provides that opportunity to be local, to be interactive, to be engaged, and to see people. Whether it's our tenants who stop by just to say hi, or it's a tenant who stop by who stops by to drop off a rent check because even though the mail works perfectly fine, their preference is to see and talk to people and just be engaged. It, for me, it's provided an avenue to be local, to work in a profession that is extremely disciplined in how it conducts its business, mm -hmm. but also flexible in how it allows the business to interact with the community and how it allows the business to participate in whether that's you know, the YMCA golf tournament from a couple weeks ago, or that's other blessings in a backpack, or Toys for Tots, other programs that we've offered things that we have. We have space, we have people. It's great to fit in in a community and then also grow and be able to see those faces as you go and walk through and attend a meeting and do those kinds of things with, with the banner of St. John Properties, which people recognize as you know, being longstanding within this community. It's been great and I've, I've enjoyed every moment of it. Yeah, we're one of the largest commercial real estate firms in the Mid-Atlantic region. So we had some name recognition associated with that. We were National Developer of the Year a couple of years ago. We're often recognized as one of the best places to work. So it's, it's a pretty fantastic place to work. We're pretty selective on the people that we include to join the team. So, you know, we are looking for people that are, um, you know, bright and shining and are, you know, want to embrace the things that we think are important as well and fit in well to our team. So, you know, what would you say to the, the new potential hires that are looking to, to join our organization? You know, so really what, how I view your organization, and it's my own personal story, is, you know, it's an incubator because you get access to every aspect of the real estate transaction, whether that's from a leasing perspective or a sales perspective or a management perspective or a construction perspective. At any one point within our system, you're touching all one or many of those different pieces, and it's a growth opportunity in itself for people that are unsure, but they're disciplined and they're focused and they're passionate about real estate, 
they're able to see every part of it and be able to decide what's the right fit for them. And that's part of why that board has 100 people on it, is that those people didn't necessarily start in their original position. I don't still put things <laughs> in a computer for accounting. I wasn't that great at it, and that's number one. But number two, um, there was opportunities for me to, to cultivate a skill set and grow within the company. And that's been a story for a lot of people, and that's a story for the tenure of the company.